I think it's the opportunities to, uh, you know, you spend four days with the guys that you grind with the whole season. So just continue to build those relationships, uh, share experiences, and, um, you know, have those special conversations that you can't take for granted or just so special that we love during, during, to have during Bull Week. So. What was the opportunity like to do the Toys for Tots thing, put some gifts together and try to help some, you know, families in need this season? Yeah, we're so blessed with what we have. So, you know, as Christians are called to use our blessings to bless others. So it's super important for us to, you know, use what God's given us to help give back to others. It's pretty good, like, getting away from the cold weather and stuff. Uh, there's a lot of more, like, I'm Hispanic, my mom's Hispanic. So like, it was kind of cool having a, I got to eat, like, good Hispanic food. And there's Cuban food out here, too. I liked it a lot. But just, like, being able to go out with my teammates and just enjoy each other's company, build each other's connections more, and just go out and have fun. It was pretty fun. What have you enjoyed the most so far this weekend? Uh, probably the beach time. There was a lot of people on our team that haven't been to the beach at all, so it was new to them. It was cool to see everybody having fun out there. Were you one of those guys that was jumping into the water? Yeah, I did end up getting in the water after everybody took it. Being here in a bowl game, it's it's a fun experience. This is what this is what you work for. I mean, it's as I spent the first two years at Tulsa and we didn't go bowl game, we didn't go to a bowl game. I realized that like it's not the easiest thing to get to. Because um, everybody wants to go and not everybody can. So I think that it takes a lot of effort and focus and discipline. But being here has been a really, really fun experience. Getting to go to the beach with all of the guys, getting to go out and hang out with them, um, be at the hotel and be at the pool and all that kind of good stuff. I, it's just been really fun. It's been one of the experiences I was looking forward to ever since we got bowl eligible. And I'm really happy to it's been fun. This one especially is fun. Just coming back to my home state, you know, um, this time I'm actually like playing a bigger role in the game, you know. Uh, just uh, my family coming down to watch me play. Just uh, this one is special for sure. It's a lot better than the 2020 Cure Bowl when, you know, no one could really travel and um, you were you were still coming off the bench in that one. Yes, yes. So that that's probably the biggest difference. It's just now for Going from being on the bench, barely playing, to starting, it's, it's going to be special for my friends and family getting to watch me play, like coming in knowing I'm going to be on the field um, for sure. At least the first play of the game, you know, just uh, special. And what's this weekend been like for you, just to not only get back home, but to go to the beach, do some fun things for your teammates, go to the Miami Dolphins training facility, and then, uh, you know, do the Toys for Tots thing? Yeah. Um, it's been real fun, man. especially the beach. It was good to be back on the beach. Uh, I missed it. But, uh, but probably the funnest part was going to the Miami Dolphins uh, Stadium. Just, uh, it was kind of like, it felt unreal for a second. So I'm like, okay, we got to practice now. Just thinking about like all the players that might, that walk the same like turf. I'm walking with like, like Tyreek Hill is be practicing on that. The same facility that was coming. Nah, this this is probably the best one here. This was uh, my last one, so it gotta be the best one. The last one gotta be the best one, man. So they usually say the first one is the best one, but nah, the last one definitely gotta be the best one for me. Just coming out here and just other people. This might this might be the last time I ever put pads on. You never know. So just knowing that I get to go out there one more time with the guys that I started this season with. That I, a lot of the guys that I started in 2018 with, just the guy who finished it in 2022, it's definitely going to be a surreal moment for me. What's, what's been your best uh, moment so far this week? Is it get to go to the beach? Is it doing toys for tots? Is it, what, what's it been? Nah, for me, it probably would be honestly just just being out with the coaches, the, uh, just hanging out with the coaches, hanging out with the players, hanging out with Braxton, Coach Hodges, the little son. Uh, just being around the guys and just having that, building more family bonds with, with a lot of these guys. Because I know these guys will definitely will be with me for life. So just making sure these guys are, just know that I love these, I love them and they're caring for For me, it's definitely what I, I love the most about having these ball games, man. What was it like going to the Dolphins practice facility? Oh man, I totally forgot about that one, but that was, that was lit. It gave me a sense of like hope. Of like maybe one day I'll get to be in one of these type of facilities with the NFL guys and just seeing um old old uh, friend uh, Taylor that works for the Miami Dolphins man was definitely a good a good uh, factor there along with that practice too.